Hello. Today we're talking about gentian. A gentian is for being discouraged after setbacks and feeling pessimistic. And if you want more information, it's on page 512 of Free to Be Me. So a gentian remedy helps to bring you back to a place of feeling more optimistic. But what often happens, this state of mind has been going on for a long time and brought you to a place of uncertainty where you keep questioning and doubting yourself. So Serato would help and support you as well to help you trust your intuition. But often what happens, we get caught up in the setback and then we go over and over and over that in our minds. And we're influenced then by those thoughts and the feelings, the emotions that go with it. So from that place, instead of being able to see an alternative way, we are stuck in that emotional state, in that mindset. So often people will call that pessimistic. Or I've had a setback, everything's gone wrong. When this has been going on for a long while, it feels discouraging for yourself. When you're around somebody in that state of mind, you might talk about all the positive things that could be going on, all the potential still there, but they cannot see that. They will be influenced by the things that have gone wrong because their mind is saying everything has gone wrong. I always pick the wrong ones. I always make mistakes. Because they've had setbacks in the past, they will assume they're going to have them again. So if you're talking about the future being all bright and rosy, they'd be like, yeah, but, and there's always a but. There's always a reason why you should be realistic. It didn't work out last time, so why should it happen this time? Yeah, but there's too many people already doing that. Yeah, but I failed last time. I made a mistake last time. And that's what's happening. Their mind is in that mindset. Now, unfortunately, this mindset could be a really strong influence from their past, from the parents, from children they associate with, from school. What's happened has become their way of being based on what their parents their peer pressure and their outside influences have created. Yeah, this one is a state of mind which can be passed on. And if you're not careful, you become like the person that you've been living with, the person that you're associating with, or the people that you associate with. You could become the negative expectation of what people have expected of you. That's quite powerful, isn't it? What if, when you're in this state of mind, that's not who you really are? What if this has just come about, this state of mind has come back to you today because of something that's happened in the past and today you can turn it around? So gentian is the remedy that helps you be more optimistic, to help you step out from that shadow of what's in the past and go out and create that bright and beautiful future. To be yourself, to sparkle, to shine, to become who you're meant to be. Tension is about optimism, it's about recovering from setbacks, seeing the learning within that, and being influenced by the future, by influenced by optimism, potential, creativity. Whatever you need is within you. When you can see the lessons within, the setbacks, you can rise above the pessimism and you can create optimism and see everything working out for you. So maybe your affirmation could be, I'm feeling optimistic and everything is working out for me today. And when you go into that mindset, guess what happens? You start attracting towards you everything that makes you feel sparkly inside, everything that makes you feel brighter, Everything that makes you happy. 
Remember, they're not coming from outside. This is a reflection of what's coming from inside. Because you've ex start to expect the best. That's what you attract towards you. And the gentian is a brilliant remedy to help you get from that I can't see a way forward. I feel stuck in my setbacks to I feel more optimistic now. Yeah. If you know someone who's pessimistic or always going on about what's gone wrong, gentian is the remedy for them. All right. It could be smaller things like I just didn't get my spellings today to loss of a job, a relationship gone well, or even on a bigger level, overcoming other people's expectations of you. All right, you can do it.